Tonight, people in the Bay Area who would like to see abortion restricted tell us it was a mistake for the court to ever declare it a constitutional right in the first place. Abortion falls under the umbrella of right to privacy, and according to legal experts, that right can cover anything from access to contraceptives to the right to marry the partner of your choice. The right to privacy is uh, wide ranging and profound, and uh, a case that re overturns Roe v. Wade isn't just chipping away at the right to privacy, it's, it's fully dismantling it. San Jose State University adjunct professor Donna Crane is concerned about rights many Americans take for granted. While Governor Gavin Newsom has vowed to keep abortion rights, Crane says Californians may still be impacted. Congress can pass any law it wants, and that applies nationwide. So it doesn't matter to some extent how many protections California builds in for women's reproductive freedom, as long as Congress wants to pass restrictive laws, and there are many, many uh, queued up to be passed, women in blue states will be just as impacted as women in Alabama. The draft opinion written by Justice Samuel Alito does point out that abortion is different from other rights in one key way. Well, these other situations, contraception and again, same-sex marriage or same-sex sexual relations, uh, don't involve that issue of uh, a non-consenting entity uh, who might need protection. UC Hastings constitutional law expert David Levine believes other privacy rights will remain intact, at least for now, but doesn't rule out the possibility of politics taking over. It's quite possible, and certainly you're going to have eager legislators uh, who want to make their name and want to, you know, restore truth and beauty to the United States uh, by rolling back these other rights. Andrea Nakano, KPIX 5.